Guess what, folks? It's time to acknowledge the Tribal Chief. The following contest is a six-man Tornado Tag Team match. Introducing first, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. This is the man who unified the WWE and Universal Championships to become undisputed WWE Universal Champion. It was a history-making WrestleMania moment, and this man has had many of those. Uh, here's a question. What has Roman Reigns done that isn't history-making? I actually agree with you, Saxton, a man who has had an indescribable impact on this industry. He's carved his legacy in stone. The Beast is here. Time for a beatdown, cowboy style. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, Brock Lesnar! Guys, talk about an intimidating individual. Yeah, Lesnar has no clue what remorse is. Just pure bloodlust. A true beast in every sense of the word. Brock Lesnar began his career dominating WWE, was nearly unstoppable in MMA, and has spent over a decade dominating the WWE landscape since returning. A man who has been virtually unstoppable. Ladies and gentlemen, when you think of WWE, you think of John Cena. Cena kickstarted the ruthless aggression era and has defined WWE ever since. And from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, the WWE Champion, John Cena! A superstar whose dominance has bordered on controversy has actually found himself as the target of scorn for some. Uh, the dominant shouldn't be controversial, Corey. If anything, he's underrated at this point. Cena's beaten a who's who of this business. Hall of Famers, living legends, Triple H, HBK, The Rock. The list goes on and on. And that bodes well for his chances here tonight. The WWE's Apex Predator is on the hunt. And from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the hardcore champion, the Viper, Randy Orton. A rare third generation superstar the viper possesses greatness coursing through his veins
And despite his family legacy, Randy Orton has forged a path of his own as one of WWE's top superstars of all time. Such an impressive array of in-ring skills possessed by the Viper. All Randy Orton needs is one RKO to end your evening. Well, Byron, I guarantee you Orton's going to show us tonight that he's much more than that. Yeah, Randy Orton is an SOB. The third man has arrived. The undisputed leader of the New World Order. And representing the NWO from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 302 pounds, the WCW Heavyweight Champion, Hollywood. This man changed sports entertainment history on July 7th, 1996. Oh, that night broke my heart. Hulk Hogan turned his back on WCW, his Hulkamaniacs, and all of his allies to form the New World Order. <laughs> No longer about saying your prayers and taking your vitamins, Byron. I guess if you ask Hollywood Hogan, the reality is that those will only take you so far. Now Hogan feels like he needs to bend the rules to get ahead. No, 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 no. Hogan is simply no longer bound by the rules, Saxton. Hulk Hogan cannot be stopped. Unmatched success in sports entertainment. Unmatched box office power and unmatched physique. Cole, what you gonna do when Hollywood runs wild on you? Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goosebump inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds. One half of the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, The Undertaker! Sinners beware, your time has come. Enter the Reaper. You could say daring to confront the Phenom is like digging your own grave. The Undertaker will drag you through the depths of despair. When you see The Undertaker, you're witnessing one of the most amazing spectacles in sports entertainment history. Without question, Michael, a merciless force of destruction. When The Undertaker is around, no one is safe. Defined dominance at WrestleMania year after year. One tombstone after the next. Fallen legends, fallen champions. The quest for everlasting life in WWE goes through the dead man, if you dare. Think of the incredible resume of The Undertaker. Won the Royal Rumble, conquered Hell in a Cell, 
and won 21 consecutive WrestleMania matches. Arguably the most incredible competitor in WWE history, and the decades of destruction continue. The wrath of the Reaper annihilates your body and your soul. Impossible to prepare for, unfeasible to predict. Every step the Phenom takes, you're one step closer to your demise. It is a grave mistake to assume that you will survive. Tag team match here with Roman Reigns, Brock Lesnar, and John Cena. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Randy Orton, Hollywood Hogan, and Undertaker. You know this is a tough match for superstars who don't play well with others. You really need to find a way to properly mix your skills with your partners. Right across the back of the show. And Roman Reigns demanding acknowledgement from the WWE Universe. Yeah. 
can believe this. I love it. That attack managed to shake up the Undertaker. Hard landing. And the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. In the barricade. Superman punched by Reigns.
And he gets set back into the ring. Let's get another look at those six superstars going head to head and toe to toe. Here are your winners Roman Reigns, Brock Lesnar, and John Cena. That's a big victory for these three here tonight. Every match is special, but this one just raised the bar even higher. I bet the whole locker room was watching this one by the end of it.